Hello, my name is Tyler Odenthal, and this is my chat fuel contribution video. The concept we will be going over today is a user background check. And a user background check is useful because you can segment your audience before they even see a welcome message. You can give them a content curated welcome message based on the data that you pull from a database or API. Um, so this is my political bot. Uh, it is currently designed to promote a political candidate for their campaign. Uh, and I'm just going to type test. And this will simulate um, the bot going out and gathering data and coming back with a curated welcome message based on who joined the bot. So I'll just type in, it's asking me for a first name, and I'll just type in Kayla. And it's asking me for a last name, and I'll type in Odenthal. And what it'll do now is uh, go to a healthcare database. So it found her inside the healthcare database. Um, and it says that she is a nurse. So now the bot knows that she is a nurse and that she should be uh, pushed down the healthcare path. So here's the welcome message that she would see. Uh, it would say, hello, Kayla. Welcome to Jay Inslee on Facebook. Uh, this bot was designed for Jay Inslee and it provides now some healthcare information to her. Um, so here's relevant healthcare links uh, that she could visit, um, and this would be the healthcare uh, welcome message that she sees. Uh, we'll just test another one. So why don't we test J? Um, so J Inslee to simulate a different database. Um, it'll go out now, and it should find him in the contributor database. Um, so anyone who's donated to a political campaign, you can find them in data.gov. Um, it's an open source uh, government ran database that you can pull from. So I found Jay Inslee inside uh, data.gov. So what you'll see now is since his total contributions is above $100, uh, he'll now see um, the join movement uh, welcome message. So this is uh, instructed to promote um, people donating to his campaign. So you'll see join our movement. We've made incredible progress um, And then some donation buttons and you can just click those um, And it should open up to like a wallet and it does so we'll test one more And we'll test mark Crayler And this will find um, him in the Occupational Apprentice database. Um, so you can see that I'm pulling from a different, uh, many different databases at once, and I'm going to be using that data to route uh, users to relevant information, even before they enter in to the bot and see the welcome message. They will be provided with content that is relevant to them. So, help, hello, Mark. Uh, it'll talk about the apprenticeship system. And it will, of course, have some links. So now that you know this information, uh, I encourage you to go out and connect APIs uh, to help better utilize and power your bots uh, with a user background check.